On this episode of Compass Conundrum, we'll be on part three of our multi-part series of our favorite hikes of Stone Mountain Park. And our number one favorite hike at Stone Mountain Park is the Cherokee Trail. It goes all the way around Stone Mountain. It's five miles and a wonderful hike. Jeff and Tanya here, Compass Conundrum. We are about to do Cherokee Trail. Cherokee Trail is probably Tanya and I's favorite hike. Stone Mountain, kind of get to go up a little bit and around. Um, and uh, it's a nice five mile hike. So we're gonna have to go up this way. Due to COVID, uh, we have all kinds of uh, uh, restrictions. We can't walk where we want to. We're gonna see the laser light show tomorrow night. And uh, all these squares, they allow four people in each one of these squares. So you rent a square now at uh, Stone Mountain Park and uh, that's your spot to sit and watch the laser light show up on the big rock. If you've never seen a laser light show, 100% something you need to do. But tomorrow night, we're gonna watch the laser light show. All right, the Cherokee Trail here at Stone Mountain Park. It goes around different areas of the park. Truly love uh, hiking this. One of our, one of our more, uh, one of our favorite trails here at Stone Mountain Park. Uh, a lot of people like to go up the mountain. We like to go around the mountain. some crazy looking trees on this trail two sets just interesting trees got a down tree and uh, this five mile hike definitely has uh, some inclines and declines has some slippery rock sections um, I wouldn't say it's advanced but I would say you know it's a moderate hike um, so five miles uh, up and around the mountain beautiful scenery we we're just listening to the birds singing to each other the ones on the right would chirp one sound and the other ones on the left side of the creek are chirping another sound First little decent uphill section, one of many. Tanya reminded me that uh, this is actually one of her favorite trail runs. Not necessarily hiking, prefer running this, but uh, today we're gonna hike it. But we have run this many times and it is, if you are a trail runner, it's a excellent uh, trail, trail run uh, to do. A little slippery on some parts, so you gotta be safe. The Cherokee Trail, you'll see the white blazes are on the rock. And so you actually get to go up. So this is one of the fun parts. Like I said, whether you're hiking or trail running, great section. Uh, they created a nice little hike through here. It's fun, um, gets you out exploring a little bit and a different perspective of hiking. So we're gonna go up and around uh, parts of the edges of this uh, Cherokee Trail. I love just all the formations of the rock. So you get to this first uh, section here, and you get a nice view from one of the sides of Stone Mountain. 
So kind of cool. Like I said, if you're a, a trail runner, this is a blast running uphill, tiring, downhill, sketchy, you know, but uh, like I said before, moderate hike, you try it right up a little bit, that section is kind of, has a little bit of elevation change and has a great view, and then uh, I'm going to kind of stay in this rocky terrain for a little bit, opens up more rock outcrops white blaze Cherokee trail five miles around stone mountain all right so got Tanya behind me and uh, going through this rock outcrop section kind of cool Try to get a different perspective uh, than what we always do. Usually you guys are looking forward, so this time you watch us hike a little bit. And, uh, you know, this is a, once again, can't say enough about Cherokee Trail. It's, uh, like I said, one of our favorites here at Stone Mountain. And uh, we try to hit this one up every time we come up here. Good five miles, good uh, little workout, and uh, got some pretty views. All right, so Cherokee Trail crosses the Stone Mountain Walk-Up Trail. A lot of people walking up the trail today. Nice day to do it, but you can see the yellow line takes you up to the top of Stone Mountain. We're gonna stay on the white blaze to finish that Cherokee Trail. I just told Tanya, I said, oh, we're in this little pine tree run. I don't know if you guys I'll kind of show you nothing but pine trees through here and anytime you find pine trees you're typically gonna look for lighter knot and so I said oh this would be a great place to find some lighter knot and sure enough Craig Sheriff would be excited to find some lighter knot that's a, a decent piece here so yeah we look for these pieces of lighter knot usually these little uh, sections here of uh, wood and uh, if you've seen some of my other videos, um, the sap kind of hardens and uh, makes the wood burn really, really well and uh, great uh, for camping. If you're ever looking to get your, your, your campfire going and burning hot, put some of that, uh, put some of that on there and you'll be good to go. So once again, uh, a lot of rock outcrop sections on this uh, hike. Um, we're about to do a cool section of it, uh, which is one of my favorite parts, which is um, the side of Stone Mountain. Well, we hope you enjoyed another average adventure with Compass Conundrum. If you like this video and want to see more, click that subscribe button below. It's the orange and white logo. And if you want to learn more about Stone Mountain and the hikes it has to offer, click the description section and see our links below. As always at Compass Conundrum, we hope that you live, learn, and explore.